to my channel. I hope you guys had a fabulous Valentine's Day. I sure did because my doorbell rang Valentine's morning. No, it wasn't Ula. It was my mailman who is the other man in my life. <laughs> a package for me from Anastasia Beverly Hills. I was so tickle pink when I tell you. I said, ooh, ooh, ooh do come in, Jeremy. <laughs> So anyway, Anastasia Beverly Hills has launched an entire collection and we've got eyeshadow palettes, we've got bronzers, and we also have liquid lipsticks. It came in a huge box and inside we had three packages of which I'm going to display and unbox for you and we are going to have what a makeup tutorial. First up was this fabulous package right here and when I open it, if I can, Ta da da da! You have a crystal, you have the soft glam palette, and right here you have a picture frame. So I'm gonna put this down and I'm going to open everything so that you guys can see. First up is the crystal. I love the crystal, I think it is so, 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 so very gorgeous. And this is what it looks like. Voila. I adore this. I'm going to have this on top of my vanity. Thank you so very much, ABH, for the little gifts that you constantly put in all of your PR packages. And this, my loves, is a picture frame. So when you open it like so, you have two little handles on top, you slide it across, and you can open it and then put in your picture. So Ula and I are going to have a picture each in this picture frame. Yeah, I'm sharing. <laughs> So you put one in here, you lock it in, and there you have it onto your mantelpiece. I will forever remember ABH for stuff like this because Ula and I travel, so we like to have memories, and this is beautiful. All right, to the main slice of the pie, we have the package Soft Glam Palette. And when you turn it around, it has the 14 colors, it has all of the ingredients. It is cruelty free, as with all of their palettes. This is the palette right here. It also has a mirror. I'm going to bend it over. You can see it's been a little bit touched up because I've used it already. It is made in the United States, apart from the brush, which is made in China, I believe. Don't quote me, but I think that it is. And here you have the shimmers as well as matte shades. I am so jazzed with this palette. As soon as I got the PR package, I had to try it out. And all of you guys from my IG family, you're like, Fumi, please recreate this look. It's so cute. We love it. We adore it. And so that's what I did for you guys today. But before we get there, I wanted to talk about the shadows. They have come out with the prism palette. They have come out with the subculture palette, which I love. They've also come out with the modern renaissance. Of all the palettes, I think that this is the most versatile. As soon as I heard soft glam, I had a funny feeling that the colors were going to be soft. They were going to be complementary. They were going to be those blendable colors that you could just smoke out. You could have a bridal look with this. You could look at a going out look with this. So voila, my loves, this is the palette. And I'm going to swatch a couple for you. So let me swatch the noir, yeah? So swatching the noir, look at how pigmented that is. Oh my God. Let us try sultry, sultry right here. Bada bing, look at it right there. Very fabulous. Let us do the rose pink. And that is a shimmer. Yes, 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 yes. And then let us do a mulberry. This was what changed the palette. The palette could have been vegan, but carmine was needed for the mulberry. So let's swatch that and see whether it was worth all of that. Yeah, da 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 da, right there. Oh yes, it does give us a punch. All right, let me try the dusty rose. I'll put it down here. Gorge. Gorge. Is that kind of blue, blue pink? Then we have Sienna, and Sienna is a repeat color, and I think orange soda is a repeat color, and these are those fantastic transition colors. So let me just swatch that for you guys so that you have an idea of what it looks like on deeper skin. I wasn't ready. Wow, that is yummy. All right, let us go with burnt orange. Let me go with burnt orange. Novena. You were playing no kind of games. Let me try glistening. Oh, this is a fabulous palette. Wowee. Let me try bronze. 
Voila. So you know what? You can tell that the palette is pigmented. Wowie kazawi. Just look at that. Now, like I'd mentioned, we had three packages. Let us go on to the bronzers. That was pretty interesting. <music> it is absolutely amazing we open it up and ah oh, look at how gorgeous gorgeous shiny and glamorous these bronzers are there are six powder bronzers different shades with the darkest shade being mahogany and that is going to be my point of concern so i'm going to open one up so that you can look at it and then what we're going to do is that we're going to have a first impressions with this puppy and i'm going to try it out in the tutorial further down so you guys can see this is what it looks like guys and can you see the pattern on it it's a beautiful blue gorgeous when we turn it around it will say mahogany powder bronzer like i said you've got six different shades i'm going to open it up and there you have it my loves this is what it looks like it looks light doesn't it well we are going to find out in the tutorial so these were the bronzers and further down yes i'm going to have a giveaway because the other five i will not be able to use let me open up another one so that you guys can see open it up look at how beautiful this is ah oh, and voila you see how light this shade is so i'm going to give away some of the bronzers for you guys with a couple of other little goodies further down the third box the last and the third box pop it open tada 11 beautiful liquid lipstick colors i'm going to swatch a couple for you here so we're going to go in with nocturnal and that's like a deep blue so i'm going to try this out right here voila let me just do it this way so that's what that looks like so this is called grim so that's what grim looks like this my loves is called insomniac it's a beautiful blue i can't wait to try this on for you guys oh my god gorgeous then this my loves is bohemian the consistency is lovely and the colors are true to the bottle and then the last but not the least is mod and guys the lipsticks retail for $20 available on the Anastasia Beverly Hills website already. I think the 6th of March, they're going to be available in retail stores and that will for sure will be Sephora and so on. So these are what the liquid lipsticks look like. The consistency is gorgeous, very pigmented, drying down already super fast. I am loving this. The Soft Glam Palette retails for $42. They are also available available the bronzer here we go darlings this retails for $28 they are all available on the ABH website go right ahead and knock yourselves out we're going to go in now into this beautiful makeup tutorial so you can see how I created this look and after that we're going to come into the conclusion and find out if this collection 
is FDV approved or not. <laughs> Sit back and enjoy, grab a drink, grab some popcorn, grab your girlfriends, and I'll see you soon. <laughs> Mahogany, the darkest powder bronzer. And there we go, we're gonna take off the film, da 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 da. I'm gonna take a brush, it's got a mirror right here. So here we go. So, ooh. Oh, I tell you, to be honest, I wasn't, oh, this is nice. This is nice. I wasn't sure if it was going to suit me. It's not much, but it's just enough. Yeah, 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 yeah. Pleasantly surprised. Okay, the bronzer is a go for me. I like it, but if you are darker than my complexion, this might just be a little too light for you. <laughs> I know the time does not stand still Can see the world when it's spinning, spinning Compensating for the moments that I spill Wish I could fly like an airplane, airplane Stop forsaking everything that I've done Won't be breaking easily now and now we're gonna go into a blush kit by ABH and I'm going to go in with this color right here the color is called Vegas yes I like that that works for this and this is my glow sugar kit I feel like this is the best highlighter on me by ABH and it's called gumdrop I don't even have to look love this so very much now I'm gonna put this on the tops of my cheeks Ooh, just want it to glow you know not too much I have a little pimple here guys it's that time of the month I know so I do get pimples every once in a while <laughs> I like it a lot it complements the soft glam let me put a little bit onto my nose right there lightly 
And then we're gonna finish off the look with ABH lip gloss and this one is called Venom. I just felt like going with a dark lip. I just thought, you know what? This might just be quite fabulous. So we're going in with a dark lip and here we go. I like that. I do like that. Then we're going to have some Morphe. Yes. I absolutely enjoyed the makeup tutorial. I absolutely love, 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 love this soft glam palette. Dare I say, this is the best palette that they have come out with to date because it is the most universal, because I think everybody can relate to this palette. It is not over the top, I tell you. The other day I was watching a tutorial by uh, Desi Perkins. She was collaborating with Nicole Richie and they were showcasing the Petite Heat by Urban Decay. By the time they had finished, it still looked like Nicole Richie didn't have anything on. Not everybody goes full on glam like I do, or most beauty gurus do. Sometimes you really just want it to be soft, you want it to be subtle, and this palette is everything and more. I didn't want to use any liner, I just totally wanted to use the palette. The colors hugely pigmented, but I think I already knew that. This entire look was all ABH. And kudos to you, Novina, because I'm just so excited. I've got mirrors, I've got blushes, I've got pencil sharpeners, I've got lipsticks, I've got highlighters, all ABH, and at such a fantastic high standard quality. Another thing that I noticed, all the beauty gurus worldwide, worldwide, not only America, we got the PR packages at the same time. I had to sit back and say to myself, these guys are on top of their A game. They've been in it for a while, but I still admire how they shipped out their PR, they shipped out everything on time. They released all the adverts for the products and everything. Amazing, I'm just really, really enjoying what they're doing right now. Moving on to the liquid lipsticks. The consistency, the color, the drying down, fabulous. No complaints on this end. The next one, which was interesting and I didn't see it coming, were the bronzers. I was pleasantly surprised and it warmed up my face. I love it so much. But I think they have to go darker still for girls like Nia Matang, I think I'm spelling her name properly, as well as Dookie. You have to go much deeper because you have still deeper skin tones than I do. So my darling, Ula! It's enough to be approved. <laughs> it is absolutely enough to be approved. Oh my God. It is gorgeous. This palette, is everything it is everything so my darlings i will see you in a couple of days until then guys love and kisses bye, bye, -bye. <laughs>